I welcome all of you on Europedia Education Platform. And you know, this uh, uh, season is going on, admission season is going on in various IITs and all. And this season is uh, going to be there till July. You know, July tak ye chalta hai admissions ka. Bohat si universities hain. There are so many universities and uh, so many colleges which are involved in this. So in March, if I uh, tell you that uh, Indian Institute of Science, IIC Bangalore, was one of the main institute, uh, uh, last date of which was 31st of March. Today is 30th March. And uh, other than that, IIT Gandhinagar, uh, last date was 27th March uh, for, uh, I think, uh, PhD program. Then Triple IIT Hyderabad, 31st March. Then uh, School of Planning and Architect Delhi. These were uh, some of the institutes plus Niti Bombay, 31st March. So other than all uh, these institutes, main institute, all other institutes have last date in April or May or June and till July. Uh, um, NITs will start in July. My, this video is for uh, those of you who are still confused between MTech and MS. Let me tell you honestly. MTech is a two years duration program, uh, two years program. This is 2.5 to 3 years program. Let me tell you that. The difference, MTech is 2 years and MS is 2.5 to 3 years. MS is also called MTech Research. It is also called MTech Research. Where is this called MTech Research? In IIT Bombay and IISC Bangalore and some more institutes also. It is called MTech Research. That is nothing but MS only. Now in India, this MTech is the term which is used in India. Abroad may this MTech is also called MS. So if you talk about US or other countries, maybe you plan for PhD abroad later on. This is called MS only. There is nothing like MTech in foreign countries. It is Indian uh, context only. This is used. Scholarship is 12,400 or 500 only. This is the same in this also. But one thing is scholarship here is offered for two years, but here scholarship is offered for 2.5 years, extendable to I think three years. Here you study less subjects, less, uh, lesser credits are basically to be studied, lesser credits, and pe there are more credits. Credits are more in MS. Now what are the advantages and disadvantages of both? You know, MTech is... Uh, Time bound. This is a time bound program. Time bound program. After two years, you are going to go out. This is professor bound. Normally, your professor is basically uh, going to like PhD. He is going to tell you whether you have done sufficient work or not. That is the only trouble for the students because professors will not permit you to submit your MS. If you have not done good work, that is a trouble. Here it is time bound. Whether you do or you don't do, two years may up bahar nikal jaoge. You may not get good credit, but you will go out. Now, good thing is more opportunity to learn. I tell you now certain more things. More opportunity to learn. So, if you want to make use of labs or learnings of IIT system or something, you can learn more in MS because you have more time. You can extend it by six more months. You can work on the projects. So, learning ke liye, this is the best. If you want to do PhD later, it is a very good program. If you want to finish it quickly, two years may, this is quick program, right? That is how it is. Interference of professors is not that much, but you are assigned a professor and then you have to listen to him. This is sometimes called mini PhD also. This is called mini PhD also. Sir, so if I want to go abroad for PhD, which one is better course? MS is better course. If I want to get into teaching, academics, research, research in ISRO, DRDO. So if I'm sitting for the interview of ISRO, DRDO, which one is preferred? MS is preferred. So in ISRO, if you see, sir, I've taken MTech research because I was inclined for the research. So I've taken MTech research, right? And MS because I was inclined for research. So if you are planning in future to go into R&D department of some top company, like if you want to get into ONGC ka R&D, ONGC has R&D department, ISRO, DRDO, teaching, uh, professorship, academics, abroad, MS is better option. If you want to get uh, fast into job, MTech is better option. Uh, it saves you six months. Now there is a question asked by students that is the most important. Sir, ye batao ki career kis mein achha banta hai? Answer is dono mein banta hai. 
सर जॉब्स किसमें अच्छी लगती है प्लेसमेंट में दोनों में लगती है जॉब इसमें भी लगती है जॉब इसमें भी लगती है सम कंपनीज हैव दिस थिंग इन माइंड सम एग्जीक्यूटिव एच आर पीपल ऑफ द कंपनी हैज दिस थिंग इन माइंड कि एमटेक गाइज हैव हाई गेट स्कोर एंड दे आर द बेटर पीपल एमटेक गाइज आर बेटर देन एम एस गाइज बिकॉज दे गेट कम विद द हाई गेट स्कोर एंड दैट इज द रीजन दे अलो एम टेक नॉट एम एस इन सम कंपनी बट आई टेल यू वन थिंग पीछे कुछ टाइम से क्या हो रहा है पिछले कुछ टाइम से दे आर चेंज इन ट्रेंड चेंज इन ट्रेंड इज लाइक पहले क्या होता था कि बीटेक यूज टू गेट गुड जॉब्स गुड सैलरीज हायर पैकेजेस एंड एमटेक यूज टू गेट लेस बिकॉज यू नो बीटेक गेटिंग इनटू आईआईटी इन जेई इज डिफिकल्ट देन गेटिंग इनटू एमटेक थ्रू गेट स्कोर एंड ऑल ऑफ लेट माय स्टूडेंट्स हैव गिवन मी फीडबैक सर दैट कंपनीज आर प्रेफरिंग द स्पेशलिस्ट व्हाई दे आर प्रेफरिंग द एमटेक और स्पेशलिस्ट बिकॉज वन अनलाइक बीटेक गाइस दे आर मोर स्पेशलिस्ट इन पर्टिकुलर डोमेन सेकेंड दे मेंटेन मोर कंसिस्टेंसी और स्टेबिलिटी बीटेक के बाद बच्चे का वो माइंड सेट होता है कि मेरे को अब्रॉड चले जाना है या मेरे को कैट लिखना है सो so, स्टेबिलिटी नहीं है लेकिन मास्टर्स वाला बच्चा स्टेबिलिटी देता है इसलिए वहां पे उनको ऑप्शन ज्यादा मिल रही है एंड सेकेंड ट्रेंड चेंज इज एम एस गाइज आर गेटिंग बेटर अपॉर्चुनिटीज एंड बेटर जॉब वाई बिकॉज दे आर लर्निंग मोर I want a CFD fellow, and I tell you very honestly, a person who is doing MS in thermal, like say IIT Bombay, me, I am doing M Tech RA in thermal, and I am doing M Tech in thermal. So M Tech RA in thermal will be knowing more about CFD. The moment this executive get to know, I want somebody in CFD, FCM. I want somebody knowledgeable in this. So they go for MS guys. So sir, jobs kis ka acha lagta hai? Dono ka lagta hai. And of late MS walon ka jada acha lag raha hai. YouTube pe main video bhi dal chuka hoon bachchon ke interaction ke saath. Where after MS they have got very good opportunities. And there are so many videos I have uploaded on panel. You just see that. And you will find that you, after MS you get better opportunities. You know there are good jobs. Every MS student is telling ke there are better opportunities. So ye jhagada, M-Tech MS ka jhagada out of gate of IITs hai. जैसे तुम आई आई के गेट के अंदर घुस जाओगे ये गेट वो वाला गेट नहीं है ग्रेजुएट एप्टीट्यूड नहीं बोल रहा हूँ ये दरवाजा है द डोर द मोमेंट यू एंटर इन टू द डोर ऑफ आई आई टी दिस एम टेक वर्सिज एम एस इज नो मोर देयर कोर वर्सिज नॉन कोर इज नो मोर देयर यू गेट इन टू आई आई टी इन एनी डिपार्टमेंट इन एनी कोर्स इफ यू पुट एफर्ट यूल गेट जॉब लिस दिस अगेन स्टेटमेंट You get into any department, engineering, earth science, rural technology, energy studies, nano science. You get into any department of IIT. You get into any course of IIT. You will get career if you put effort in right direction. So push yourself so that you get into some good uh, institute. MS होता कहाँ पे है सर? IIT में भी होता है, IIT में भी होता है, NITs में भी होता है, NITs में भी होता है. NITs में and new IITs में MS courses are lesser than Old established IITs, MS courses are lesser in new IITs and NITs compared to old established IITs. M Tech के लिए gate score is the only thing which matters. CGPA is not important term. CGPA is not very important. Interview normally will not be there on in M Tech. Interview normally will not be there, but still there is interview. In MS, your CGPA should be really good. Gate score, even if it is less, CGPA should be good, and interview will be there. Interview will be there. Now, typically, what you should do is you should apply in both M Tech as well as MS because opportunities are there. My last piece of advice to all the students: when you apply, apply generously. Do not apply in very very, uh, I'll say frugal manner. You apply gen generously, like that means apply more, apply in more places. No doubt, you are to spend more money. You are to spend for each form more money. But that money may come back in your first scholarship itself when you get into masters or PhD or something like that. So apply in more places. There is a probability you get call and there is a probability you get selection. So there are three steps. First you apply, then you get interview call, then you get selected, and then you choose the particular specialization. So you need to apply more places for that. Many people will say, "Yar, isme apply karu ke nahi call aayega ke nahi aayega." Even if you find 40-50% probability, you should apply. That mentors will guide you where you are to apply, and probability is more. You apply there, and at the same time, do not wait. That when call will come, I will start preparing for interview. Start preparing for interview beforehand. And uh, I have provided entire information to you on the panel how to prepare, how to uh, basically read this. So start preparing in uh, in beforehand only. So apply in more places. Sir, I am not interested in MS. Forget about it as of now. Just apply. 
and the moment you get selected sir i got selected in ms iit uh, indore in vlsi sir i am getting uh, communication in iit madras sir i am getting ms in data science in iit trichinopoly so which should i choose sir out of these three options then i am going to tell you which one is the best but you apply you should have some options in your hand do not hesitate in applying there are more number of seats in iits than the people who join these why because of these hesitations only you people do not apply and this is uh, march going on april may june july august may session will start these next four months you need to make crucial decision for you so that august onward you start getting scholarship you start getting good place uh, uh, basically platforms for uh, your uh, further higher education and you basically put yourself in comfortable position so push yourself so that you get some opportunity in the summers i hope i made my point clear now you apply in that direction i'll keep on popping up with more information thank you